last weekend of the month of November and Saturday was very wet. In fact, you take a look at the rain totals over this weekend. Corpus Christi International, the airport saw 1.33. Now keep in mind, if you're west of Crosstown, west of the airport, west of downtown, you most likely saw about three to four inches. In addition to areas along SPID, Beaville, two and a half inches of rain and Port Aransas. About three and a half, closing in on four in some spots out to our north and east. Temperatures today, thanks to the cooler air from the north, maxed out at 71 here in Corpus Christi, upper 60s in Beville. So overall, a cooler air mass is in place, which is helping uh, for a cool night up ahead. And temperatures will fall pretty quickly overnight tonight and to tomorrow morning. Much cooler this week, cold mornings on tap and low rain chances, aside from a few isolated showers coming up on Wednesday. We're looking at a very stable weather flow going forward through next weekend. Now take a look at radar northeast of the city into the southeastern United States. You can see Alabama, Georgia, portions of the panhandle of Florida, all seeing the rainmaking system that brought us our rain earlier this weekend. And it's all moving east and northeast away from uh, Texas and it's going to be a pretty powerful storm system as it rides up the east coast over the next several days. In its wake, high pressure is starting to build in and we may see a few high level clouds over the next several days, but all in all, it's going to be a sunny forecast going forward and mostly clear. Right now, 66 here in Corpus Christi, 49 in San Angelo, middle to upper 40s out in the panhandle of Texas. Keep in mind that is actually their near their afternoon highs for this Sunday, and some of those numbers are going to make its way towards Corpus Christi uh, later on tonight and most likely into early Tuesday morning. Right now, middle to upper 60s, lower 60s out to our northwest. Out the door, north winds in place at about 15 to 20 miles an hour. Here in Corpus Christi, Flower Bluff, Port A and Rockport. So overall a breezy night up ahead and temperatures the big story by late tonight around let's say 10 o'clock around 56 here in city in the city. So you're gonna need a light jacket late tonight if you have any Sunday night plans. Now overnight tonight and tomorrow morning temperatures are gonna plummet into the middle to upper 40s. So tomorrow morning very cold, chilly by um, by South Texas standards and then by tomorrow afternoon a nice warm up into the upper 50s and lower 60s. That is below average for this time of year, by the way. Now the big story going forward into early Tuesday morning, which looks like it'll be the coldest out of the next seven days. Overnight lows at middle to upper 30s early Tuesday morning, and that is the big story going forward as we go into Tuesday morning around 35 to 38 here in the city, 53 tomorrow, uh, at least a Wednesday morning and then lower to middle 40s through Friday and this weekend. As I mentioned, those are overnight lows here at Corpus Christi tomorrow for your uh, Monday forecast. Looks pretty good. A high temperature of 60, mostly clear and mostly sunny. But as I mentioned, a cold morning is on tap and the cold mornings extend for the next seven days. Early Tuesday morning, middle to upper 30s, high temperatures in the 60s. Small rain chance coming up on Wednesday. A few isolated showers possible. Otherwise, a dry forecast going forward and very chilly in the mornings.